y'all home. We're the real Hebrew Israelites coming to you week in and week out, prophesying the downfall of America. First and foremost, I want to give all honor and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, double honor to the apostles of Great Millstone and Salutations to the Aki and pushing this word in truth and sincerity. Kai, um, and basically, man, hey, since we started off saying, I'll pray to Yahweh Shai, this is uh, this open forum, but let's let's start on that topic. Uh, can we get uh, in the gospel? Let's take it to John 17. He that uh, speaking of himself. Oh. Uh. Yeah. Him, him, will you, uh... No, no, um, no. Him speaking of himself, seeking his own glory. He's not basically okay. like, you know, fuck. I'm gonna get the one that says, you know. I, I, can, I, can, get, I can find it. It's John 7. I thought, yeah, John 7. You know, I said 17. So, like, it's John 7, brothers. It's 7, 17. Right. This is uh, John chapter 7, verse 16. Yahweh shall answer them, My doctrine is not mine, but his that sent me. If any man will do his will, he shall know of the doctrine, whether it be of the Most High or whether I speak of myself. Right. If, if you really understand, you will know if what we're speaking is of our own, you know, or if it's of the Heavenly Father. All right, because we're not seeking to make ourselves a fucking name. We're not just trying to seek fame in this fucking kingdom, in this kingdom, man. We only speaking about Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Can you get First Corinthians two, Kawadi? Okay. We only speaking Yahweh Shai, man. Right. And him crucified. <laughs> so, so, all right, and and, and, re, and brought back to life by who Yahweh? All right, so we here to give praise and honor glory to the Heavenly Father, man. The Lord is only gonna save Israel for His, his name's sake, anyway, man. It's for His name. Hey, can we get that scripture on deck? Uh, for my name's sake, I said, we can hold him. Let's lock, let's lock it in, you know? All right, this is all for, that, this is all for the Heavenly Father, not our fucking self. If you just take time to think about that, you would know that. Shit, and a lot of times, here, brothers even talk down about themselves, man. How Jake is basically is the offscore, man. Filthy rags. Brothers really know we ain't shit, man. If Isaiah said his God is righteous as filthy rags, we already know. Why do you think we all, why do you think we teach and preach the elect? See, the other camp will teach the preach the elect because they teach the preach the elect. They have to also teach the fact that they ain't shit. The only reason any of us is going, is going to receive salvation is according to the will of the Heavenly Father. All right, like Paul said, there's uh, there's none that do righteousness, man. He ain't said, are we better than they? He said, no, man, none is righteous. This is all according to the will of the Heavenly Father, man. So he's rather to be praised, man. This is according to his will, man. We don't speak about it. That's why we give you the truth raw and uncut. Despite, frankly, we don't give a fuck. That, <laughs> hey, like, you, you, can, you can hate us. Mm -hmm. and, and in fact, good, that's even better. That means we're doing what's right according to the Lord. That means that we uh, fit the descriptions of the men that spoke about in the scriptures as being the men of the Lord. That's right, bro. I got something, if I may. Oh, yeah, of course. Uh, this is John chapter 5 and 43. I am come in my father's name, and ye receive me not. Right, hey, there you go. I have come in my father's name. And it said, and you receive him not. You know why? Because you're, you're, hey, you're, you're, they are their father the devil, man. All right, if you're speaking about, man, if you're not pumping your heart, and your shine, and, and, and then there's something wrong with you, man. Even when we get, even when we get down on brothers, all right, other camps, it's the correct, it's correct them so they can be uh, on point with Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Now to say, oh yeah, we corrected your ass. Shit, we corrected why they get right, we don't mention no more, it's over, who gives the fucking fuck? That's right. All right, if you really correct yourself, why, why would we mention it, man? <laughs> and then these other camps, man, that even the ones that do use his name, y'all don't push it, man. Y'all put it on the back burner, man. Right. When you preach it, you pushing the word, you're not exalting his name. The scriptures say exalted your voice, but you just exalting your voice and you exalting yourself. Like if you look at the Bach video, it's a Bach. Right, it says, Bach says, says 30, 39 straight on fire. Bach did that, I did it. That's just like, hey, that ain't that why the Lord got mad at Moses? He said, I got to cleave this rock for y'all ass. You know what I'm saying? You know? But, um, yeah, John 5 and 43, I have come in my father's name and ye receive me not. 
If another shall come in his own name, him ye will receive. Kind. It's that simple, man. That's why they wanted. That's what, it's like, it's like, oh, that's why they wanted Barabbas, man. Uh, Barabbas, man, you know. That was chief keeping the reincarnation, man. Y'all wanted, wanted that nigga to come out, man. He probably had dreadlocks and everything, like a wild man and shit. How can you believe which receive honor one of another? And seek not the honor that cometh from your house. Right. Own. They seek the mm. honor from one of another, man. Yeah. Not from the Heavenly Father. Yeah. That's why they conform to shit. That's why they don't mind going, to, uh, going amongst men that don't uh, teach and agree with the same doctrine. Alright? So, so, so uh, suppress the, their, their, the name of the Lord because they don't agree on the name. Alright? Suppress, uh, uh, um, suppress the doctrine. Alright? Because they don't agree on doctrines. That's madness, man. All right, uh, not not fully living according to Heavenly Father, man. To fit in with some other shit, getting praise and props. Anytime somebody that don't agree with you is on your page, saying yeah, you're you're a cool one. You're not like the, mm -hmm. the, the 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 GMS guys, right? Hey, Luke six and twenty six makes it very clear. You don't want to be that type, man. That's getting those honors on this Ooh. side. We seek after the honor of Heavenly Father, man. Shit, we're not trying to please you. Right. We're trying to please the the uh, the the man, the, uh, the man that sent us, man. Ooh, okay. Go ahead, brother. This, uh, this is uh, Luke 6 and 26. Woe unto you when all men shall speak well of you. For so did their fathers to the false prophets. Hmm. <laughs> right, man. Destruction on you to you when, when, uh, when, when men shall speak well of you, man. Because that makes you a friend of this world, man, which makes you an enemy of the Most High. Mm -hmm. Puts you on the right, right on the shit list, man. I have a scripture for you, brother. Man. This is John twelve and forty two. It says, nevertheless, among the chief rulers also many believed on him, but because of the Pharisees, wicked Pharisees, mind you, they did not confess him, lest they should be put out of the synagogue, for they loved the praise of men. More than the praise of the Most High. Kind. Go ahead, brother. You got it. <laughs> Just walk by. It so. says, um, verse 44. Yahweh Shai cried and said, He that believeth on me believeth not on me, but on him that sent me. And he that seeth me seeth him that sent me. You know, so it goes back to Yahweh Shai not uh, 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 coming for his own glory. Everything he said, he said, I come in the Father's name. You know, as I overheard the brother read uh, read the scripture. You know, but uh, many many among the chief rulers believed on him. Hey, a lot of you niggas know that. Uh, 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 Help you go scratch Come on, brother. Yeah, hey, we took all the sleeping spots. <laughs> <laughs> this is locked. This brother took his last one. But um, uh, a lot of you niggas know. That the Lord is dealing with a, a great millstone, man. Starting with the apostles on down, man. A lot of you niggas know, but you afraid to uh, uh, be looked down on, to be talked bad to, man. Right. Because, hey, like it says in verse 43, for they love the praise of men more than the praise of the Heavenly Father. You know? That's why we get the, the, the truth directly and, <clears throat> directly and correctly, man. That's right. That's why we don't shun and give you the whole doctrine, man. That's why we don't, hey, we're not trying to make it fit to what you're used to, man. Oh, yeah, now we scoff at rape all this time. And yeah, it's in there, but it's a case of emergency. And now I don't mention it no more. They don't mention it no more. They, they don't, they don't mention, it, mention that with GMS no more. It's just, uh, it's over with. Motherfucker, it's, it's, it's what it is, man. If you stop fucking trying to make things fit for the world, you will get it. Mm -hmm. You will get it, and then you can really see how wonderful the, the, the word of the Lord is, man. Mm -hmm. All right? Hey, get Jude Which is why he, this is why he deserved the praise, man. He's, he's for one, his word is is, is gonna uh, is gonna it is performing all the all the things that's written. Mm -hmm. But the word itself, man, when you get into it and you see it, man, you can really surely say, surely the Lord did purify His word seven times, man. Mm -hmm. And that's why He needs the praise, man. That's why we go ahead and do this, man, for Him to come, for, for people can realize His kingdom is coming. All right, so people can understand the name Yahweh, man. All right, go out there and proclaim the name Yahweh, Mahashem Yahweh Shai, man. Yep. All right, amongst our brethren. 
Alright. Bob, the scriptures, because uh, try to like get him and hold him because I'm forgetting. Yeah, I'm, I'm, all still, of them. I'm still holding that Isaiah for you, too. All good. Yeah, Isaiah for you. Two and two. I got you. No, no, if I could uh, uh, hit this precept real fast. This is Ephesians 4, and I'm going to start at uh, 3. It says, endeavoring to keep the unity of the spirit in the bond of peace. The unity, the togetherness, right? There is one body and one spirit, even as you are called in one hope of your calling. Mm -hmm. One Lord, one faith, one baptism, one power and father of all who is above all and through all and in you all. So when Yahweh Shah came, he came preaching in the name of his father. And the disciples, when uh, uh, when Yahweh Shah ascended, uh, 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 when he died and ascended, the disciples was preaching what? Was preaching Yahweh Shah, right? Because Yahweh Shah came in the name of his father. So likewise, we preach the same thing. Now, Yahweh Shah came preaching, didn't in John, um, is it 15? He said, all the things that uh, I have learned of the father, I have made known unto thee. Right? And then the apostles in turn, Paul wrote and said, I have I have not declared, uh, uh, I, I just butchered the hell out of it. I have not shunned to declare unto you all the gospel. One gospel, one faith, one doctrine, man. You know, I'm probably going all the, uh, around, but it's straight to the point, it's one doctrine. So all you guys coming together and, 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 and mixing shit together, man. Hey, and James is speak about uh, uh, not mixing uh, uh Sweet water with bitter, mm -hmm. you know. I got that Isaiah for you though. This is Isaiah forty-eight and verse nine. She like the girl. Hit that. Curve. You want the Corinthians? Uh, this uh Second Corinthians. I mean, First Corinthians. This First Corinthians. Two. First Corinthians. Second chapter. Two, All right. Two. First. Start at one. All right. This First Corinthians chapter two, verse one. And I, brethren, when I came to you, came not with excellency of speech or of wisdom, declaring unto you the testimony of the Most High. For I determined not to know anything among you, save Yahweh Shai Mashiach and him uh, crucified. Right, so we're not out here to get our, uh, for one, our own glory by thinking we some some great men or something like that. No, we preach what we preach what we're commanded to preach. The word of Heavenly Father, man. And that's it, that's all. So he can get his honor. Alright? So he can get his glory, man, as he deserves. Alright? Uh, yeah, man, that's it for my brother. Come on, this is, uh... This is, uh, Isaiah 48 and verse 9. It says, For my name's sake will I defer my anger, and for my praise will I... Rip, Salaki. And for my praise... Will I refrain for thee that I cut thee not off? Behold, I have refined thee, but not with silver. I have chosen thee in the furnace of affliction. For my own sake, even for my own sake, will I do it. All right, so where, where, where is pride, man? Where is boasting? All right, All right where is word about making friends with you guys, man? Where, where, where is changing the doctrine of fitting with people when shit? <laughs> The only way you make it is, is, the, is the Heavenly Father, man. And when the scriptures tell you, why trimmest thou, I believe it's Jeremiah the second yeah. chapter, though, it says, said. why trimmest thou thy way to seek that. love, man. Yeah. All these scriptures that, hey, you niggas negate, hey, because it's just you niggas is blinded, man. Ultimately, you are not chosen. You know, the scripture says that uh, uh, my sheep hear my voice. A stranger, they will not follow, man. Right, man. Then you got this damn guy, Sakari, talking about, um, oh, yeah, man, we, we all had the same doctrine. We all had the doctrine of Yahweh Shah. Everybody there had the uh, doctrine of Yahweh Shah. And you got Old Testament niggas in there <laughs> that don't even believe in Yahweh Shah. Come on, man. It says, uh, for my own sake, even for my own sake will I do it, for how should my name be polluted? And I will not give my glory unto another. Sure. You know? And, and you niggas gathering together, man. Hey, that's polluting the name of y'all by Shah Yahweh Shah. Because all you niggas got different doctrines and this nigga believe. That's confusion, man. <sighs> Shit, if, if if Jake was just doing that, Jake would never make it out of America. Out of, Jake would die. Because then the elect never get raised up. <laughs>
Hey, cause hey, as, as it says in Sirach thirty nine, it says it is plain unto uh, 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 unto the holy, but as it is stumbling blocks unto the wicked, man. Right. How, even during the time of Yahweh Shai, during the time of Acts, you had the fucking uh, uh, wicked Pharisees, the wicked scribes, the wicked Sadducees. These motherfuckers had different doctrines, but they came together just to attack the apostles, man. Mm -hmm. Just to attack the Yahweh Shai. This, this shit is repeating over again, but you nigga, hey, because the Lord ain't opening your eyes to see it. Y'all don't know what the hell is going on, man. The hell is going on, man. Y'all blind. Um, I got one. Can you get that jewel for me? This is uh, Jude chapter 1, verse 16. These are murmurers and complainers walking after their own lust. Right, and they, and they just like Sakari, man. Murmuring, complaining. Oh man, why are they talking shit about me? As scripture say, when the spirit of the king uh, rises against you, keep your place, man. You talking about Sakari? Yeah. The guy said the only reason he even make videos on Jim is because Jim S made videos on him. Wow. Right. That's that's really for real. That's, that's backbiting. Really. <laughs> exactly. Dude, the, the the videos are made to correct you, man. When the apostles were caught through the spirit came and told you, don't link up. Uh, that should have linked up, linked up with them dudes, um, the African niggas. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that was to warn you, man. Cause now look, now look how far, how far that 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 one seed of iniquity. Now look how big it has grown, and you don't even realize that you are fucking going off of it. Amos three and three is the most Hebrews one o one scripture, man. They got, hey man, the scriptures, it's glass shattering. It's, it's, it's scriptures that just, it's just house of cards scriptures, man. God. It says, and their mouth speaketh great swelling words. Right, y'all talk, hey man, you, you talking big shit, man. Throwing rocks at the throne, man. Go ahead. Having men's persons in admiration. Admiration. Hey, hey man, that's the mentality that y'all all have, man. Having men's persons and admiration, man. Go ahead. Because of advantage. Because of advantage, man. You get some kudos from a motherfucker, man. So you can hang around black consciousness, motherfuckers. Nate, all up in this high seat, man. Them high, them high. Uh, what did it say about the scribes and Pharisees, man? They seek the the high the seats, the high, the eminent seats. You just want to be the man, man. Okay? But you, hey, man, if you don't, you not waiting on the Lord, man. The scriptures say, wait ye upon me, man. Go ahead, brother. You guys. All right, so uh, this is basically for, you know, anybody who's looking for that high seat. You know what I'm saying? It's uh, Galatians 6 and 3. It says, for if a man think himself to be something when he is nothing. That's right. He deceiving himself. So you deceiving yourself trying to go after this uh, corruptible, uh, corruptible crown on this side, man. Right, and uh, we seeking an incorruptible crown, man. Everything, hey, all you fucking guys is fallible, man. Y'all all, y'all all, all, all. This is not the kingdom, man. Hey, man, and ultimately, man, our job is to, to teach and preach as Yahweh Shai told us, man. Yeah, yeah, hey, it's rough and austere, how ugly it may be. Hey, what did Yahweh Shai say? Bless he was not offended in me, man. That's right. I must work the works of my oh, father yeah, while it's day. Alright, uh, back in um, Jude chapter 1, sorry, 17, it says, But beloved, remember ye the words which were spoken before uh, before of the apostles of the Lord Yahweh Shai, how that they told you there should be mockers in the last times who should walk after their own ungodly lusts. These be they who separate themselves sensual, 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 having not the spirit, but ye beloved. Right. Also. And that's what happened with Sakari, man. Hey, that's all them niggas. Hey, all, all, all you, all y'all, man. Y'all separate, raise yourself from the doctrine. Y'all separate yourself from these scriptures, man. Y'all say, look, man, the scriptures don't matter. Doctrine don't matter. Whatever the Lord put down and commanded me to do, it don't matter. I'm just gonna go off my own heart. My so own you emotion. can get a name. So you can be so that government, be, man. Right, right. That's the that's the lift yourself up. Exactly. He that exalts himself shall be abased, man. 
Instead of just doing the work of y'all about y'all shot, man. And you don't even know how you gonna say you the fucking governor of Yasharala. And we hoping to be the elect, man. Exactly. Well, yeah. Paul, Paul himself, Paul, the man that was taught by Yahweh Shah himself after being risen, said, well, he dare not count himself. Exactly. See, part one and number, man. Hey, but y'all don't even know. This, the funny part about the whole deal is, y'all are sitting in Moses' seat. Y'all are. You are actually are the government, man. Y'all are sitting in that seat. But that seat is... The hard seat. Hey man, that's an electric chair. <laughs> Y'all, well, you mean like you mean on the left hand side? On the left hand side, those wicked. wicked that's what I'm saying. Because yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, Pastor Hard technically, you know, is in that in that seat, man. He is the head. Yeah, he is the head. Come, so you know what I'm saying. But y'all, those same Pharisees and scribes, that was that same government that crucified Yahweh shot. Right. That wanted that. That wanted that power. That wanted their name and to still be known, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. I got a uh, precept. Oh, yeah, we'll go ahead, slide, mm -hmm. go ahead. Uh, this is uh, Isaiah 30 and 9 that this is a rebellious people lying children 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 that will not hear the law of Yahweh right and that means the whole thing man not just part of it you need to have 100% of the truth man okay. <laughs> nigga said hey we all everybody in there had the doctrine of Yahweh shot Hey, well, Yahweh Shah said in Hebrews 10 and 7, Lo, I come in the volume of the book, it is written to me. Be, they couldn't even agree on the fucking name. Well, hey, he, made a video, he made a video said that uh, everybody that did call him Nathan Howell and Yahweh Shah. But uh, I don't know how when the, 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 the Deuteronomy 23 7 thing came up, the house he went, the house of, uh, house of consciousness. Right, the, 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 the nigga in there said, yeah, we, we don't hate Edomites. What? Oh wow! But, but I'm saying, so Carson, he was with the House of Conscience. Oh yeah, when that when that so was how, out, he so, went with him. So what are you said was was they there, or was you off site somewhere? That's neither here nor there. Y'all didn't even agree on that. Yeah. Hey, hey, you know, got corrected. That's fine, cool. But what about the Mark of the Beast? Because yeah, you because you teach what the Mark of the Beast is. Uh huh. And he teach that Cornelius is an Israelite. That's right. Zabak and H O B C, which they both was there. They teach that he ain't a mic. Hey, and it was an Old Testament dude that corrected them on the rape shit. And he was there. And he did a whole video saying that the Apostle Tahar, GMS, they correct about what they say about Deuteronomy, what's the 20th chapter? Uh, when you get the, the shekel, uh... Oh, uh, I think, I don't, 20 or 21. Yeah, yeah, well, you know... The, 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 20, the, the chapter you're going to, man, y'all yeah, watch the videos, man. Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> So yeah, so hey, he broke it down on camera. He said, "Look, man, it said in the Torah because he just did with the Torah." So and that's going. So he don't even believe when Yahweh shot. He don't even. He said he believed Yahweh shot was a war general. I believe he was a war general. Well, man, that, that, see, that's the whole point, man. <laughs> they don't believe when Yahweh shot in the scripture. See, bottom line. So. And then you don't even worship Yahweh shot, so you already fucked up, man. Well, who's reading? Oh, go ahead. Uh, it said, which say to the seers, oh, this verse, uh, Isaiah 30 and 10, which say to the seers, see not unto the prophets, and to the prophets, prophesy not unto us right things, speak unto us smooth things, prophesy deceits. Right. And that, that's, and that's what Jake ended up doing, man, conforming to that shit. Making plays and shit. And upload it on YouTube, man. Sue's saying. What the fuck does a play got to do? A Bible play, man. <laughs> All right? You're reading it, but you're not even breaking it down. <laughs> How's that edifying, man? <laughs> Fucking you know, what, what is that, man? That's, like... just, that's just to make the shit comfortable for, like I said, they, they uh, subvert old houses, man. God. Carrying away uh, silly, silly women laden with iniquity, man. That's for women that got a bunch of fucking kids yep. by a bunch of different dudes. To go there and all oh, Israelite like, and go there and watch that shit. Which yeah. for the just for the record's sake, I mean we are in America and our women are whores. So if you happen to wake up to Yahweh and Yahweh Shai and you got a bunch of kids, a bunch of different dudes, right. and you watch this video <laughs> and you really believe just it, <laughs> at least you listen to the truth. We all need mercy. I said it earlier, man. All of us are fucked up. We, we all wretched. Okay. <laughs> we all dead. That's why we. That's why this is going. That's why we got to do this according to how y'all. Why y'all should I say it, man? Right. This man. is a thing, man. And this is First, first Thessalonians, two <laughs> and three. For for our exhortation was um. 
This is First Thessalonians two and one. For yourselves, brethren, know our interest into you and unto you, that it was not in vain. But even after that, we had suffered before and were shamefully entreated, as you know, at Philippi, we were bold in our power to speak unto you the gospel of the Most High with much contention. And nobody does that, man. And y'all don't have demons coming out there shooting at y'all and shit like literally shooting, coming out there with guns to shoot at y'all, man. Or like, or like when the brothers on, and, uh, on 79th uh -huh. in cottage. The one guy came back, 87. He came back to shoot at the brothers, but the Lord set up a demon. A whole random bitch that was bugged out coming to get naked. And dude didn't even do the shooting. And he was bugged out and came not catch the brothers, man. But then he was still finna do it. Like, I gotta do it. He was like a dude from Lord of the Rings talking to himself and shit bugged out. Smeagol. <laughs> Alright, y'all don't deal with shit like that. Much contention, man. Everybody in Israel come against GMS. Much content. And we don't give a fuck. <laughs> hey, like Paul said, he did much content, hey, man. We who are ready to die salute you, man. Alright. <laughs> for our exhortation was not of deceit. And now you go, man. We're not we giving you the truth, man, the full truth. According to how about Shmiel Shai, because it's our duty, man. Nor of uncleanness, nor in guile. <laughs> And that word for deceit right there in the literal, because my, I got the, 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 got the translation, the word there for deceit is error. So just being wrong. Just being fucking wrong. We're not coming to you with wrong, with wrong stuff, man. Alright? We give you the 100% truth. Nor of uncleanness, nor in gal, which is deceit. Or, uh, 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 fuck, what's the word? It's the, it's, it's the. Uh, gal. No, this is gal. The opposite of uh, fucking being diligent, slothful. I can think of. It. I don't want to say. I don't want to say lazy. Slothful. Okay. What's really what that gal is, man? And nobody, hey, labors like great millstone, man. So you can't say that we got that that we got gal, man. And we do it as sincere. We don't do it to get our own name. We do it to edify. We do it because this is our joy. Like shit. Well, this is the, the best fun in the fucking world. As we were allowed of the Most High and out of fear of the Heavenly Father, man. And ultimately, that's the spirit he put on us. There's a lot of fear of us there, man. But as we were allowed of the Most High to be put in trust with the gospel, even so we speak. Mm -hmm. Alright? We we consider what we have, man. Alright? The Lord trusts us to, to look at the flock, man. That weighs on our brains, man. It really fucking weighs on our minds. <laughs> And, and, and that's something you guys on the outside man, this video is not to them. We just address them in case they get a chance to you know, repent. But we're not to y'all. So the brothers, y'all already know, man, this is what Paul wrote this letter to. It's not to them on the outside. It's, it, it's said for yourselves, brethren, no. So, brethren, you know, man, how we think about the flock. And for young brothers that don't know, man, we fucking think about the flock. Yeah. And that's the spirit you're supposed to have. I mean, I mean constantly, constantly. Thinking in your head, man, am, am I a perfect example or, or strive to be a good example for the younger brothers? Or uh, how, did I act like this in this situation and that situation? Hey, you niggas don't even give a fuck, man. Mm -hmm. You niggas act, hey, you niggas still act like niggas, man. You niggas, hey, yeah, you niggas is niggas with Hebrew names, man. You don't give a fuck how you act. Niggas disrespecting your elders. How, how do you expect somebody to respect you if you're not respecting somebody? Come on, man. And not, they're not even follow an example that the apostles said. They, they don't get down, uh, 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 Salakia. Fuck. I can't think of his name. He's with Comfy now. High Priest Ariel. Ariel. Oh, yeah. All right. They don't get down on, on him, man. That's right. They had, And that's the example they set before us. Mm -hmm. And we don't have a, and, and there's no reason to even want to get down on the apostles. Right. They're not going off. That's the exactly. funny part. I mean, they men, they in living the flesh. I'm going to leave like I said, man, like John said, man, they're not going off. So that's nothing correct. Yeah, please, I'll go ahead and slide here. I got to finish this. This is uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 11 and 1. Be ye followers of me, even as I am also, even as I also am of Mashiach. So in order to be a follower of, of Mashiach Yahweh Shai, you have to follow, follow the path that he set and laid out for you, man. All right? Now I praise you, brethren, that you remember me in all things 
and keep the ordinances as I delivered them to you. As I do, damn. As right. I delivered them. All right. How Paul taught Yahweh Shai man. How the apostles teach. <laughs> teach Yahweh Shai. That's the example and what we hold on to, man, and follow after. Because that's how the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Shai, set it up. Mm -hmm. That's his word. That's the proper way. Let me finish this. Um, but as we were allowed of the most highly put in church with the gospel, even so we speak. Not as pleasing men, but the most high which triumph our hearts. Mm -hmm. Alright? For neither at any time use we flattering words. And that's the thing you guys don't get, man. This, this, this is about character building, man. A trial of hearts, man. To show you're going to make the right decisions in them tough times, man. Are you going to be a brother even when you just are uh, uh, are just barely above the other brother to just be and have God just help him. Alright, you may it's a trial of the hearts, man. Mm -hmm. Alright, having integrity. I'm gonna leave it at that. Um for neither any time is we flattering words as you know, nor a cloak of covetousness. The most high is witness. Mm -hmm. Nor of man saw we glory, neither of you. So you're like, look, we didn't try to get, we didn't, we didn't change up to get glory from niggas on the outside, and we ain't trying to get glory from you all, like the brothers amongst us, man. We trying to be found acceptable to the heavenly Father, man, and we so we gonna look across the word, which the word does say, you know, uh, uh, bow down to great men, okay. It tells you to get the love of congregation, so, you, so of course you gotta be brotherly. That's part of being man of the Lord, man. But you're not seeking to get to get the glory from the man of the Lord, man. Of course, it's nice to have the elders look over you with joy because you're doing the right things. But you're not seeking glory from from men. You're seeking from the heavenly Father. And the hell with everybody on the outside. <laughs> Ooh, I got one. Uh, this is uh, Sirach thirty-two and one. If thou be made the master of a feast. Lift not thyself up, but be among them as one of the rest. Take diligent care for them, and do so sit down. Go ahead, break it down, brother. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. So if you made master of the feast, the head, and you guys call yourself the government of Israel, okay? You, you want to exalt yourself, you want to be these guys, man. That's why our scripture says, man, if your delight be in thrones, and accept it on the wisdom, right? So that way you may reign forever. And the wise thing, the beginning of the wisdom, is to fear Yahweh by Shemi Shai. That means if you fear Yahweh by Shemi Shai, you're going to keep the ordinance as he gave it to him. That's like, look, man, I tell you, go to the store, look, man, all right? Hey, 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 little, hey, little motherfucker, I want go give me a pack of Newports and 40 ounce, you know what I'm saying? Bag of chips, your uncle talking to you and shit. Okay, you go to the store. Alright, you go give him what he put on that list, man. You ain't gonna, you know what I'm saying, bring him back some extra or some other shit. Okay? Lift not thyself up. You're not supposed to exalt yourself, man. We 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 uh in mourning right now, man. We wait for the Lord to, to lift us up out the dung hill right now, man. But be among them as one of the rest, take diligent care of them. Take diligent care of them. This, hey, did not Yahweh Shai say feed my sheep? Okay? So you're not going to feed shit to your sheep? And so sit down. Right? Sit your ass down. Okay? Be, that's it. For sure. Yeah. I mean... I like that, la that last part. Yeah, really, yeah. yeah. Alright, uh... Right, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's a little bit more. I had forgot about it. It's been a while. Can I read it? Okay, bro. Okay. Um, and when thou hast done all thy office, take thy place that thou mayest be married with them. Right, man. Because, yeah, that, right, man. That, that's how you gain your reward, man. And, and when we make it in the kingdom, we be married together, man. Right now, it's time to be in the house of mourning and receive right. a crown for they well ordered of the feast. And receive that crown, that that righteous, that uncorruptible crown, man. Right, God. Right now, right now, we we're, we're bitter to the marriage, man. 
Right now it's time to labor. Just come on in. Show on, brother. It's going to be chill. It's going to be chill for now. You here? You're going to stay for a minute, right? You here? You're going to stay for a minute. Come. So we 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 labor right now. Right now it's time to labor. Like it says in Hebrews, man. Then there should be rest. Okay? Um, let me read this verse and then go to finish it. <clears throat> now, uh, 1 Thessalonians 2 and 6. Nor of men saw we glory, neither of you nor yet of others, but we might have been burdensome as the apostles of Mashiach. Okay. I'm gonna keep going. Man. <laughs> I want man, spirit, want spirit, want. The video is long, so like your brothers, you know. But we were gentle among you, even as a nurse cherished her children. Hey, man, you, were, the brothers on the inside, understands, man, how the brothers really feel feel about each other, and especially our heads, man. Our heads really looking after us, man. You know, and I can speak personally for a couple of the apostles that I, I have met. Come right, on. and but, but I know the brothers here, the elders of, here in Chicago, personally, man, that I deal with on regular, and I can say for sure that that's and brothers and brothers, not even the elders, brothers, that's not the top two, the the the, the men, period, man. How we look after each other, man. Oh. And you know how you prove it? The labor, the love, man, the breaking the bread, the doing this work. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. Also, how we treat each other, live amongst each other, but keep it pure and whole and, and holy and truth. Yep, because Yahweh Shah said, This is how men shall know that you are my disciples and have God. love one toward another. God. In the law of Leviticus, it speaks about not suffering sin upon thy brother, man. Right, you should correct. Them. So, if he going off, whether uh, 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 in the flesh or whether on doctrine, it is to be corrected. And you niggas showing that y'all hate each other by not correcting each other, man. Men shall become lovers of themselves. Okay. You, you, you don't fucking love Salaki. You don't. Y'all you, some damn liars, man. Hey, man, love is not emotion, man. It's an action, man. And it and it's an action that's driven with emotion, right? You know what I'm saying? It's driven. It's it's an emotional thing. You know what I'm saying? But it's driven with emotion, man. You know what I'm saying? Like if one of your brothers cross you, man, you want to. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to beat his ass. You know what I'm saying? Like, not you. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, if you lust, that's why you don't suffer sin on your brother, man. You rebuke him sharply, man. Because you, if you love him, you don't want to see him go down the wrong road, man. So being affectionately desires of you, we were willing to have imparted unto you not the gospel of the Most High only, but also our own souls, because ye were dear unto us. For ye remember, brethren, our labor and our labor and travail, for laboring night and day, <laughs> bro. Man. Hey, the I can know, man. You know, it's not to, to boast, man, but the, the apostles and, and the brothers do videos all the time, man. Break bread at all hours, man. Yeah. Sacrifice sleep, sacrifice a lot of things, man. To labor, man, to show that they truly care and love to love. Shalom. 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 And the brother have a whole conversation, edify that brother back and forth, you know. <laughs> hey, like you said, man, brothers in the know, we know, man. I think I have to read this whole chapter. Whatever precept you got to link up what I'm saying, bring them out, because I'm, I'm going to read the whole chapter. Go, go ahead, brother. So please bring the precepts out, brothers. Um, this is fucking wow. Uh, what verse is that? For ye remember, brother, thy labor and travail... For laboring night and day, because ye would not be charged once any of you, we preached unto you the gospel of the Most High. Right, it says, uh, because we would not be charged once any of you, we preached unto you the gospel of the Most High, man. 
We don't want that blood on our hands, man. So we, we preach this truth, man, wholeheartedly, labor. Have uh so the uh so this truth can have a uh, free course, man. I'm gonna get that, man. Ye are witnesses, and the most high also, how holily and justly and unblameably we behaved ourselves among you that believe. Alright, now you go again, man. This is really amongst those who get it, man. To the rest of the hell with you. You're not gonna get it. That's why we worry about you. This is to, to the men that believe, man. That's right. Alright. As you know how we exhorted and comforted and charged every one of you, as the father doth his children. That ye will walk worthily, slot, that ye will walk worthy of the Most High, who have called you unto His, slot, unto His kingdom and glory. So that's how we walk, man. Hey, which the Spirit, man, we follow the path, the Yahweh Shai, because yeah, that's who called us, man. He's called us into immortality, to His kingdom and glory. How are we not gonna, how are we not gonna walk according to His, to His, to his commands? If you are, if you really desired. Uh, immortality, how the hell do you expect to get it by not falling after what, he, what he's told, telling us, man? If you really want mercy and salvation, all right, how are you not going to walk according to him? No, because you, you, these people on the outside want what, man? The false prophets want that glory now, man. They're not, they can't see you far off. They, they don't have faith, which is the gift from the Heavenly Father. Right, it's Ephesians 4, I'm going to start at the top. It says, I therefore the prisoner of the Lord beseech you that ye walk worthy of the vocation wherewith ye are called. With all lowliness and meekness, with long suffering, forbearing one another in love. God. Endeavoring to keep the unity of the spirit in the bond of peace. Which we read earlier, it says, there is one body and one spirit, even as ye are called in one hope of your calling. One Lord, one faith, one baptism, one power and father of all who is above all and through all and in you all. Now I'm going to jump down to, uh, to verse, verse 13. I'm going to start at 12. It says, for the perfecting of the saints, for the work of the ministry, for the edifying of the body of Yahweh Shai, till we all come in the unity of faith. The unity of faith, man. The agreement. The one, <laughs> the, strong, the Strong's G1775, it says unity. It says in Strong's definition, the oneness, man. Right. The scripture says that the uh, 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 that they shall see eye to eye in, uh, in Isaiah, man. Okay. So we shall agree on all points, man. And that's true love, man. True love is teaching 100% truth, man. And if you stumble, man, correcting it. And, and stand on that path of Yahweh Shai, man. All right? That's true love, man. Mm -hmm. Making sure your brothers, making sure you, you, you're teaching your brothers proper doctrine, man. Okay. Being a proper righteous example to the brothers. Labor for the brothers, man. Being that for each other, like it says, man. All right? Being gentle and caring towards each other, man. Now, as men, of course. Mm -hmm. So you got to get on somebody that gives somebody. We're still men. But be man gentle. <laughs> <laughs> it says till we all come in the unity of the faith and of the knowledge of the son of the heavenly father and that's how you honor and show love to the heavenly father too uh, just for, just for record we're going to put that part over alright if you can get, get uh, 1 John about if you uh, if you love the uh, if, you, if you, he didn't say you love the Messiah you love his brother Right, he is a liar. No, no, it's still the same chapter, but I think it's towards the end when it say, if you say you love the Most High, you must love the brother that he's saying. Mm -hmm. uh, I get it. Read what you was reading, brother. You got y'all verse. Kind of 420 or 20. I'm going to go ahead with that. You want 4 and 21? Yeah, go ahead, just read what you It's uh, back in Ephesians 4 and 13. It says, till we all come in the unity of the faith, the oneness of the faith, right? And of the knowledge of the Son of the Most High, unto a perfect man, unto the measure of the stature of the fullness of Yahweh Shah, that we henceforth be no more children tossed to and fro and carried about with every wind of doctrine. And that's what you niggas do, man. Hmm. By the slight of men and cunning craftiness, whereby they lie and wait to deceive. Mm -hmm. But speaking the <laughs> truth in love, 
may grow up into him in all there things. There you go. Hey, that's the spirit. Speaking of truth and love, man. Cause we don't we we hey if Paul said it, man, he said his desires are all Israel be saved. Hey, we get down on you motherfuckers, but really, if we didn't care, we wouldn't say shit to uh, we wouldn't mention it. We we just that's go true. We, we wouldn't even really need to post video. I mean, church out there is earth, sure. We can just go outside and just teach. And then they like to just come here and then we just talk amongst ourselves. Oof. And we show love out towards everybody, man. As our Heavenly Father did, man. He called us to reign on both the good and, uh, and the bad, man. And mm -hmm. we showing mad love, B. It says, but speaking the truth and love may grow up into him in all things, which is the head, even Yahweh Shah. Mm -hmm. And now if I could jump over to 1 John, the fourth uh, slot, 1 John, the third chapter, and I'm going to read um, the 14th verse. It says, we know that we have passed from death unto life because we love the brethren. God. He that loveth not his brother abideth in death. Whosoever hateth his brother is a murderer, and ye know that no murderer hath eternal life abiding in him. So if you preaching Yahweh, why Yahweh Shah? If you, for example, the spirit keep bringing you, you up, you long-haired bastard. Sakari, man. You preach the same thing the apostles preach, man. You Basically, you pretty much in the same doctrine. For the most so, part. For the most part, right? So, hey, you hate you a murderer, man, because you hating your brother. Let alone an elder who taught you, man. That's right. Your father in the spirit, man. Right. And that's it. And what? It says there's one sin that can't be uh, forgiven. It's blasphemy. And uh, you can pull it up in Ephesians, because I think it's Ephesians. It tells you if you go against uh, your masters, man, that's, that's blasphemy. Okay, man. I got something as well. Basically, going to um, back up against the murder about, you know, being a murderer and stuff. This is um, 1 John 4 and 20. It says, if a man say, I love the most high and hate his brother, he is a liar. So if you murdering your brother, guess what? You, your intentions is to kill off, uh, kill off what the most high is talking about. And it says, for he that loveth not his brother... Whom he has seen, how can he love the most high? Exactly, man. He has not seen. It? Hey, that's why the scriptures say that they they uh, flay their skin from above them, man. The scriptures say they flay they they, they, they call them, put them in the oh, cold. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So the bones trying to come together, the sinews trying to come together, and you fucking chopping their damn skin off of them, man. You know, You're trying to keep them dead, to keeping them in the, right in the congregation of the dead, man. This is read verse twenty one. Oh, no, I can uh, Verse 21, it says, And this commandment have we f have we from him, that he was loved of the Most High, love his well, brother also. Read it, read it, read it, read it. Okay, uh, this is uh, 1 John chapter 4, verse 21. And it says, And this commandment have we from him, that he who loveth the Most High, love his brother also. Kind. That's just what it is, man. Our right. truth and love. We get, we, you got to get the truth, man. You, that's how you follow up the Yahweh Bashmi mm -hmm. You have to teach his doctrine as he said, man. To reach the elect. <laughs> because what we, it said, the uh, harvest is ready. Mm -hmm. But the <laughs> laborers are few, man. <laughs> that's the whole point. If you love if you love Israel, man, you're going to labor, man. So we can get the fuck out of here. Come. And, you're gonna, and you know what? You know, as we love Israel. But we got to say to him the two thirds, man. Because dealing with that should hold you back. Mm -hmm. yeah. We got to focus on the prize, man. We'll see y'all on the side. And that's you gotta teach this truth 100 percent man, and love, man. Yep. Hey, the scripture says man loves his light. So if you worried and and and, 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 and so caught up with the two-thirds, man, because cause you is one. Hey. The Lord told Ezra is what he tell him. He said, Hey man, don't worry about the, the, yeah. the people that perish, man. Right. Don't worry about them, bro. Right. We're, we're get so what them. about that? What 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 do y'all say about scriptures like that, man? Did Jeremiah say pray not for his people, man? Hey, in fact, Jeremiah, see, you know what? Now, the thing is, you guys uh, are really weak in the spirit because when you first look up to the truth in his realm, 
you can have that Jeremiah spirit. You know, you're like, yeah, Israel love. Mm -hmm. You want to do this, do that, teach everybody. Mm -hmm. And then I was like that. And I remember yeah. one time, I was outside, I woke up like, man, you know, what's your nationality? That was my thing. I asked, what's your nationality? That was a quick little, you know. Mm -hmm. And uh, one time, I asked a guy, and that nigga turned around and snapped. I said, fuck it. Fuck you, man. Nigga. I ain't say shit to him. Like fuck you, man, nigga. Mm -hmm. That was a quick. That was a quick lesson early on. Like, all right, that ain't gonna last. <laughs> fuck these niggas. Mm -hmm. And then what happened with Jeremiah, man? Mm -hmm. He eventually like, you know, I came to you for good for these people, man. Yo. Look, man, let them be killed. Let their families be killed. <laughs> Destroy their ass, man. Hey, so we ain't got time. Hey, you false prophets fall in line with that. Yo. That was the main ones that would come against them. We, we don't have time for that shit. Yep. Cause the, Lord, hey, the Lord told Jeremiah to go to, uh, there was Hananiah, and tell him, when he broke the contract, said, well, you did that, but I'm going to put harder, I'm going to put harder yep. yokes on, on Israel, yep. and you're going to die this year, nigga. Mm -hmm. And his ass hey, really died. Do you, know, you think Jeremiah was linking up with this nigga, being cool with him? When dude said what he said, Jeremiah went and cut his ass. Yep. And then when dude came back to Jeremiah, he cut him again, and he told us that's going to die. Mm -hmm. You niggas gonna start dying, man. Yep. Yeah. Hey, hey, look at it like this, right? When uh, uh, Apollos, when he ran into uh, 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 the tent makers, the tent makers that came, Priscilla and Aquila, Priscilla and Aquila, when he ran into uh, uh, Aquila, Apollos, right? He said uh, Apollos only knew the baptism yeah. of John. Yep. So if it wasn't about the doctrine, why did Aquila further expound on to the Holy Hour I'll grab it for you. Right. Now, I thought it ain't all about the doctrine. Well, then they should they should have let Apollos continue teaching what he was teaching. But they expired on him further, man. Mm -hmm. Meaning they further edified him. Like, no, okay, this is this and that is that and that. They gave him the correct. Go ahead, brother. Slock it. Right. I have to know where this is at, bro. <laughs> hey, Ask, was, oh, sorry, go ahead, brother. You received not the love of the truth, man. Huh. This is Acts 18, 20, uh, 24. And a certain Jew named Apollos, born in Alexandria, an eloquent man and mighty in the scriptures, came to Ephesus. This man was instructed in the way of Yahweh, and being firm in his spirit, he spake and taught diligently the things of the Lord, knowing only the baptism of John. Mm -hmm. And he began to speak boldly in the synagogue. All right, so even what he had, you know, he was out there teaching that. Mm -hmm. All right, he wasn't holding his back, his holding back his sword, man. Doing the work of the Lord deceitfully. Linking up with his niggas being cool with him. Alright? No, he talked he talked the, the right way. Um, and he began to speak boldly at that, man. What changing up his doctrine, man, and trying to fit in. And the synagogue, whom when Aquila and Priscilla had heard, they took him unto them and expounded to him the way of the most high more perfectly. Mm -hmm. And when he was dis disposed to pass into Achaia. The brethren wrote, exhorting the disciples to receive him, who when he was come, helped, you know, he did after he got built up. Uh, when he was come, helped them much, which had believed through grace. He <laughs> helped them. Because he, he was an eloquent, mighty man already. Yep. Because he got in line. He received it like, oh, shit. Like, look, brother, like, you want to keep saying. He received the love of the truth. Right. He received it and was like, well, shit. It's he got, true. He got that better understanding, man. Yeah. Okay. Right? God. Why didn't why didn't Aquila just let him uh yeah, y'all he preaching, let him let him go ahead and preach what he preaching. It's cool. God. Hey, and let's check it. Where he mightily convinced the Jews, and that word for convinced right there, I'm getting the Greek. I'm getting the Greek. So I can should be refuted. Convinced. Uh, so G one two four six. The the ak at elika. <laughs> this is the long ass word. Yeah, <laughs> Ain't even trying to say it. That shit sound crazy. The ak at elika because of the. All right, bro. Greek. What? The ak at elagokamai. I think I got it. The ak at elagokamai. To confuse with rivalry and effort or in the contest. Uh, to prove downright that is confute, convince. So he was in a uh, confute with rivalry, man. He was correcting a. He was 
giving them the truth, man. Whatever they understand, whatever they went off on, he was giving it to them. Mm -hmm. That's our job, man. That's why they stoned Stephen. Mm -hmm. That's why they killed Howard Shot. Yep. For teaching the truth of the Heavenly Father. And who the fuck was it that uh, Paul cussed out that he delivered unto Satan for uh, overthrowing the faith to some? Teaching that the yeah. resurrection was passed already? See, because it's all about the doctrine, man. Right. Fuck is you, what, 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 what are we doing here? What are we doing here? You go to the gym, you know, I just, I just come to the gym to hang out. You go to the gym to talk about doing uh, karate moves and shit. Hey, the scripture says, uh, uh, roughly paraphrasing, the doctrine that tended to life, man. But it ain't about the doctrine. It's all about the doctrine, nigga. It's crazy, man. Uh, okay. Let me hit this for the brother. This second Timothy 2 and 15, which is funny, it's linked with this. Uh, I'm going to start at 12. Yeah. If we suffer, we, we shall also reign with him. If we deny him, he also will deny us. If we believe not, yet he abideth faithful, he cannot deny himself. Of these things, put them in remembrance. <laughs> I'm going to hit 12 again. If we suffer, we should also reign with him. So we got to suffer, okay? We got to go, th go through the bitter, all right? And that's how we get the reign with Yahushua. If we deny him, we, he also deny us. Denying him means that when the truth is coming to us, correction has come to us, we don't accept to take hold of it. If we deny him, he will he, he will deny us. That's right. All right? And that's what you guys are doing, man. You guys are denying how shy. Because the truth is out there, man. Hey, that's funny. A few things came up about on that topic about the, the tree of life actually being open, man. And you guys are denying it. Hmm. If we believe not, yet he abided in faith, he cannot deny himself. Of these things put them in remembrance, charge them before the Lord that they strive not about words to no profit, but to the subverting of the hearers. Study to show thyself approved unto the Most High, a, rope, a workman that needeth not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth. Rightly, man. Directly and correctly, man. Ortho, mm -hmm. ortho, 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 to cut straight. To cut straight ways. To proceed <laughs> on straight paths. Ooh, ooh. To, yes, take hold of the tree of life. Mm -hmm. Alright? To follow that path that you have a shy set, man. Have your feet washed. That's right. Um, hold a straight course. Equivalent to doing right. To make straight and smooth. To handle a right. To teach the truth directly and correctly. <laughs> okay. Um, I was reading the phone. Uh, all right. But shun profane and vain babblers. Says to shun it. How do you suck with that, man? It says the word to place around one, to stand around, to turn oneself about for the purpose of avoiding something. All right. To keep away from. Okay, you shun it, man. For they will increase unto more ungodliness. Hey, just just watch. Hey, depending on how much time left in this play, just watch them guys, man. And keep a close eye on that Sakura guy, man. Because the scriptures tell you that they folly will be made known, man. Or every, everything will be made known, man. The, the, who the men of Lord is going to be made known and who the wicked is going to be made known, man. You can't already fucking see it. Uh... And their word will eat as Dr. Canker, of whom is Hymenaeus and Philetus. Alright? <laughs> whom concerning the truth have erred, saying that the resurrection is past already and overthrow the faith of some. Okay, so look. That ha it's happened. It happens, man. Somebody got to be the two thirds. But right here, man, it's very clear. It's about that doctrine, man. Because these guys got given over to Satan. Okay, these guys, these guys got casted out for the teacher of false doctrine, man, and and could overthrowing the faith of some. That's why they got to get killed, man, because now we they got gathered, 
And it was a waste of fucking time. Now we got to labor more, man. Yeah. That blood has got to be on your hands, man. Mm-hmm. Subversion. Nevertheless, the foundation of the Most High stands assured. Having this seal, Yahweh know of them that are his. And let everyone that nameth the name of Mashiach depart from iniquity. All right? And it says, uh, he who suffer has ceased from sin. You got to deal with that bitter, man. Y'all motherfuckers getting praise from men. So y'all ain't, you know, that's as bad as Sarah does. Like, you read Luke 6, 26. I just go ahead. They receive their reward, they, uh consolation. You go ahead, you want to do something else? Uh, this is the uh, first, I mean, Second Thessalonians, Second Second Thessalonians, uh, three and one. I'm gonna read down to seven. Finally, brethren, pray for us that the word of Yahweh may have free course, right? And hey, this, hey, like that living water, man. You know that free course, that river, man. And we can't let you. Uh, we gotta be the Captain Planet, man. Make sure the sly sludge don't come. You know what I'm saying? Pull all the pollutants and shit into our damn into the rivers, man. Into the into the pure rivers, man. We can't let you pollute the doctrine, man. And be glorified, even as it is with you, and that we may be delivered from the unreasonable and wicked men. And that's you guys, man. Uh, especially these damn black conscious niggas. You had uh, bro polite trying to sick some gangbangers on us, man. That's an unreasonable and wicked man, man. And you hang out with those guys, man. For all men have not faith. Right, man. And that's the thing, man. You guys don't believe what y'all reading, man. It's just a uh, dog and pony show. But Yahweh is faithful, who shall establish you and keep you from evil. And we have confidence in Yahweh touching you, that ye both do and will do the things which we command you. Right, man. So we got, we was commanded to, to keep these ordinances as we was given them and to give them as we received them, okay? And not change it, not change the story, all right? And Yahweh direct your hearts into the love of Yahweh. And what is the love of Yahweh? The truth, like we said earlier. You have not received the love of the truth. And into the patient waiting for Mashiach. Now we command you, brethren, in the name of our Lord Yahweh Shai Mashiach, that ye withdraw yourselves from every brother that walketh disorderly. So this is a commandment, man. You post to withdraw yourself from somebody that's not walking in, abiding in the same doctrine that you went to, man. And not after the tradition which he received of us. For ye yourselves know how ye ought to follow us, for we behave not ourselves disorderly among you. Right? We not disorderly, man. We all speaking the same thing, man. Okay? This, um, this, um, Amos chapter 3, verse 3, it says, Can two walk together except they be agreed? You know, that's why, that's why we can't, um, that's why we ain't on the same line. That's why we ain't on the same accord. Because you talked in another doctrine, man. You're not on the same page as the elders that you learned from. And um, the other brothers that learned from the elders. And uh, even if you didn't learn from the elders, you're not on the same page as the elders, which is supposed to be on the same page with. Mm -hmm. The Lord always set up men to, that's going to teach. Jeremiah 3.15. Yeah. You got something about that? Oh, some that? No, no, no. Okay. Come, because the scriptures speak about one doctrine. And when it speak about, well, I'm going to just read it. This is uh, 1 Timothy 4 and 1. Now the, now the Spirit speaketh expressly that in the latter times some shall depart from the faith, that one doctrine shall depart from the faith, giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils. So when you're in a group and it's more than one doctrine, it's of devils, <laughs> of deceivers, Right? Speaking lies and hypocrisy, having their hypocrisy. Because first they say, oh, no, no Edomite can make it. What? The Lord hates Edomites. Oh, but Cornelius is the one chosen Edomite that can right. be saved. Right, but his household also, because the next it, it chapter, say his, yep. it says his household. Yep. His son's an Edomite. His daughter, whatever, it don't say which can what he had, but, you know, well, I don't know off the top, I just say, I don't say it. But it said his household, man. Uh -huh. 
It says, speaking lies and hypocrisy, having their conscience seared with a hot iron. I'm going to jump down to uh, verse 6. It says, if thou put the brethren in remembrance of these things, thou shalt be a good minister of Yahweh nourished up in the words of faith and of good doctrine. One, whereunto thou hast attained. Now I'm going to jump down to verse 16. Take heed unto thyself and unto the doctrine. One, continue in them. For in doing this, thou shalt both save thyself and them that hear thee. Man. Right. And just as uh, Hamanes uh, got himself murdered, and those men that had faith got overthrown, that fell out, man. Mm -hmm. The blind lead the blind, just as the righteous lead the righteous. All things are double, man. The blind lead the blind, they both shall fall into a ditch. Right? Yeah. So, and the righteous, what? To, to lead, okay, the Lord said set up leaders, man. So, to, to, to lead means, what? Some people follow him. That's right. And it said the prophets are subject to the prophets. So we we uh prefer one another. <laughs> you know? Which means we all lead by example to one another. Whatever strength another brother got, he set the example for another brother that may be lacking in it. So we all can do business, man, grow in gifts and talents, man. Gain more wisdom. Uh this is first Thessalonians two and eleven uh, ten. Ye are witnesses in the most high also how holy and justly and unblamably we behaved ourselves among you that believe. As you know we how we exhorted and comforted and charged every one of you as a father doth his children, give them that truth, man, doing his labor and love. That ye will walk worthy of the most high who hath called unto his kingdom and glory. We and look, the thing is, what did it say? We we doing this labor so you also can walk after Heavenly Father and, and receive the kingdom. So we can save ourselves and them that hear us, man. For this cause also thank we the most high without ceasing. Because when we when ye received the word of the most high, which ye heard of us, ye received it not as the word of men, but as it, but as it is in truth, the word of the most high, which effect which effectually worketh also in you that believe. And that's what this is, man. Ultimately you have to receive this word in truth, man. Like the brothers said, man, you have to receive the love of the truth. All right, and that, and and for the fact that the brothers do wake up, man, we do get things on side. We pray for the brotherhood, man, and we pray for the to, for all the uh, elect to get waking so we get out of here. So we happy we get more laborers to come, man. But because but we that's why we teach that truth because uh, once the elect is sealed, that's how we get out of here. So it, on every manner and way possible, it's best to just teach the truth 100%. No matter what the fuck people say or do to you, because that's, the, that's, the, that's how you get out of America, man, by doing the work of the Lord. Man. Mm -hmm. Because hey, the scriptures speak about a, 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 a woe is me if I preach not the gospel. God. What's the gospel? Gospel means good news. What's the good news? The good news is they that Yahweh Bashav Yahweh Shah is going to come redeem us out of this fucked up situation we in. You're right. Uh, and that, and, and, that, their way. and that we going to govern over the heathens, man. We're going to govern the world, the universe. That's the good news, man. So how can the gospel be preached unto an Edomite? How is it good news to them, man? How can the gospel be preached to a Moabite or an Ammonite, man? Especially them. That's fucking madness, man. <laughs> okay, um... For ye, brethren, became followers of the churches of the Most High, which Judea are in Mashiach, Yahweh Shai. That's the thing, man. The Lord, Yahweh Shai, has churches set up, man. Elect men that we follow. And that's how you get built unto receiving the kingdom and glory from the Heavenly Father. All right? For ye also have suffered like things of their own countrymen, even as they have of the Jews. And we suffer, man. And all the GMS, man, the brothers that's in the truth, we suffer, man. Because you get, you, well, for one, we suffer from just affliction, period. But, you know, but you guys think to add affliction to our bonds, like it says in Philippians. By scoffing and coming against us and making scoff videos and slandering the brothers. But we deal with it, man. That's why I said you think to add affliction, man. Um, 
But look, who both killed the Lord Yahweh Shai and their own prophets in the past. That's what you've done. All Jerusalem, Jerusalem, thou which killest thy prophets, man. Hey, if this was that time, back then, you would fucking want to kill us. And have persecuted us, and they, and look, and they pleased not the Most High, and are contrary to all men. <laughs> they contrary to everybody, even to themselves. They don't agree. Forb uh, forbidding us to speak to the Gentiles that they might be saved to fill up their sins always for the wrath that's come upon them to the to the uttermost. But we brethren been taken from you for a short time in presence, not in heart endeavor to more abundantly to see your face of great desire. Uh, I'm going to just finish the last two verses. Wherefore we will have come unto you even like Paul once and again, but Satan hindered us. For what is our hope or joy or crown of rejoicing? Are not even ye in the presence of our Lord Yahweh Shai at his coming? So we rejoice at the brethren also being uh, being saved by the Heavenly Father. That's our rejoicing. We're going to join in that, man. We, that's why we labor, man. We labor for the brethren. Out of love. Sincere love, man. Man, that's why we teach you 100% the truth, man. No matter what what fucking affliction comes with it, what you, other, what you fucking contrary assholes say about it, All right, and you got it, and you got it. It's about that doctrine, man. This is about what Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai said. For the salvation is for His name's sake. Hey, I had to take away from the scriptures anyway. Kind of, hey, purify seven times. Go ahead. Pass something. Um, this is uh, Sirach twenty four. And Dang. I'm gonna get straight to the point though. So Rock 24 and 24. It says, Faint not to be strong in the Lord, that he may confirm you. Cleave unto him, for the Lord Almighty is the most high alone, and besides him there is no other Savior. He filleth all things with his wisdom. As Pison and as Tigris in the time of the new fruits. He maketh the understanding to abound like Euphrates and as Jordan in the time of harvest. He maketh the doctrine, one, of knowledge appear as the light and as the Gion in the time of vintage. The first man knew her not perfectly, no more shall the last uh, find her out. For her thoughts are more than the sea and her counsels profounder than the great deep. I also came out as a brook from a river. And as a conduit into a garden, I said, I will water my best garden, and I will water abundantly my garden bed. And lo, my brook became a river, and my river became a sea. Basically, a uh, Deuteronomy 32nd chapter, I believe it's the second verse, says, My doctrine, one, shall drop as the rain. Yahweh shall say that uh, he that believeth on me, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. No, wait, no. That's not what I'm saying. He that believeth on me, out of the scripture has said, right? What did I say? He that believed on me out his belly shall fall the rivers of living. As the scripture has That's said. That's very important. Come. I know. I, I'm not doing you. I'm doing that in the, like, towards them. Like, Come. you got to do what the scripture said, That's man. right. That's right. 100% doctrine. That's right. <laughs> That's right. You know? <laughs> hey, they, man. It says, uh, I'm going to read 31 again. It says, I said I will water my best garden and will water abundantly my garden bed. And lo, my brook became a river, and my river became a sea. I will yet make doctrine to shine as the morning, one doctrine, and will send forth her light afar off. I will yet pour out doctrine as prophecy, and leave it to all ages forever. So who, who, who was back in uh, Sirach 24, and uh, now I'm in verse 33 again, I'll read 33, it says, I will yet pour out doctrine as prophecy, and leave it to all ages forever. And who else is out here prophesying? Only great millstones, starting with the apostles and elders on down. And they, they, the scholars even said, they say, now I, I've seen it's been mentioned more than once. Different scholars said, uh, yeah, great millstone, y'all, y'all, y'all doing, y'all uh, terrible. They scoffing at us, y'all this day, y'all this day. But y'all, y'all only want the prophecies. Y'all only deal with the prophecies. That's all y'all know is the prophecies. That's crazy. That's 
what the hell are we supposed to be? That's the proof that we the men of the Lord. That's right. When that makes the entire prophecy. book is, is right. The entire book is prophecies. The Lord was telling us the end from the beginning. Okay. As it is written. Even when we break down the too late, we break it down prophecies. Yeah. <laughs> Everything we teach is a prophecy. Either it already happened or it's been happened. Right. <laughs> the ones that happened in the past were used to build faith. And, 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 and as Ecclesiastes, the first chapter says, the thing that has been is which that shall be. Exactly. Because a lot of those prophecies that, that prophecies that did happen is going to happen again. They twofold. They, and they happening now before our eyes. Especially now. This is the fucking end. And then on top of that, man, <laughs> Amos 3 and 7, man. God, yeah. it, it mentions prophets. What do prophets do? They prophesy, man. And that's how you get the secrets <laughs> of the heavens. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so it says, I will yet pour out doctrine as prophecy. And they covet the, uh, the best, the best gift. Right, that's that's right. Right. What, what, what do you people read? Mm -hmm. Oh, y'all read for y'all own y'all read for yourself. Y'all right. reason y'all can try to come against us. Y'all watch and try to lurk and see what, what y'all can say against us. Or y'all fucking well sorry, some man's not receiving the love of the truth. Go ahead. It says, and leave it to all ages forever. Behold, that I have not labored for myself only, but for all of them that seek wisdom. Yeah. I endure all things for the elect's sake, that they may obtain the same salvation, man. Yeah. And it says that I will pour out doctrine as prophecy. Can you grab that, Brother Bible Bishai? This is Revelations chapter 19, verse 10. It says, And I fell at his feet to worship him. And he said unto me, See thou do it not. I am thy fellow servant and of thy brethren that have the testimony of Yahweh Shai. Worship the Most High for the testimony of Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy. And that's plain in itself, man. <laughs> and that's plain in itself. So those that are prophesying have the, uh, directly and correctly have the spirit uh, of Yahweh Shai on them, man. This is... um. This is um so happy. Yeah, this is uh First Corinthians two and sixteen. It says, who, "For who have known the mind of the Lord that He may instruct him? But we have the mind of Yahweh Shai, man. So just uh, playing, man. Brothers, got anything else? Yes, I can ask you. I was holding uh, Proverbs three and five. Because hey man, this is the true doctrine, man. This is the this is the doctrine of Yahweh why Yahweh shot. And if you ain't following it, John the tenth chapter, man. If you ain't going through the sheepfold, man, through that door, which Yahweh Shah is the door, then yeah, you are you are a, a, a thief and a robber, man. You climbing up some other way, man. Let him be a curse. If any man preach Another, <laughs> right? any other doctrine then let him be accursed. Then he, which he have received, mm -hmm. let him be accursed, man. Go ahead, bro. Uh, this is uh, Proverbs 3 and 5. Uh, trust in Yahweh with all thine heart. Do what? It says, trust in Yahweh with all thine heart. Mm -hmm. And lean not on unto thine own understanding. In all thy works, acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy path. And that's beautiful, man. And that's beautiful. Lean not to thy own understanding. Hey, as it is written, let every, let the most high be true, but every man a liar, man. Jeremiah 17 and 9 says that the uh, the, the heart is deceitful amongst... Uh, uh, matter of fact, let me get it, because I don't want to butcher it. Want me to keep reading? Yeah, if, if, if it's more, bro. Be not wise in thy own eyes... Fear Yahweh and depart from evil. And how do you do that? How can a man cleanse his way by taking by uh, uh, taking heed to the word, man? Huh. To the doctrine, one. To the gospel, the good news. Mm -hmm. Orthotomeo, man, directly and correctly that this word must be taught. This is uh, Jeremiah seventeen and nine. It says, "The heart is deceitful above all things and desperately wicked. Who can know it?" So, man, we stick to the scriptures, precept upon precept, precept upon precept, man. Bro, got anything else? He got one, and I got one. Go ahead, read 
Alright, this is um, 1 Timothy chapter 1, verse 3. As I besought thee to abide still at Ephesus, Ephesus, Ephesus. Ephesus when I went into Macedonia, that thou mightest charge some that they teach no other doctrine, neither give heed to fables and endless genealogies which minister questions rather than godly edifying which is in faith so right. do. Hey man, no other doctrine. I got one more. This is a uh, this is uh second John one and ten. If there come any unto you and bring not this doctrine, receive him not into you. Did it say doctrines? If in, any bring not this doctrine, receive him not into <laughs> your house, neither bid him your house speed. But he that biddeth him your house speed is partaker of his evil. Yep. And all you niggas is partaker of each other's fucking wickedness, man. He that condemned the just and he that uh, he that condemned the just and justified the wicked, man. Even they both are an abomination. Yeah, and the other one says even his prayer so get it. is an abomination, man. So you're not guilty. You think you can just... <laughs> Brothers got anything else? Hmm. You got something else? Might. Uh, this uh, uh, First John 2 and 3. And hereby we do know that we know him if we uh, keep his commandments. He that said, I know him and keep his, not his commandments is a liar and the truth is not in him. Mm -hmm. And the truth is not in him. <laughs> <laughs> the love of the truth. Right. And, and it's the, about and the doctrine, man, the truth. 100% right. truth, man. Yeah, that's right. And, and a part of that commandment is uh, to, uh, to be not un unequally yoked with non-believers, man. Yeah. Yeah. What concord has Yahweh shot with idols, man? With Belial. And as, uh, and as uh, Paul wrote in the Corinthians, he said, what fellowship have the temple with the Most High, which are which are us, with idols, man, with the harlot, man. Hey. So you sure. niggas mingled in some... So like, you go here, brother. Hey, so the throne of iniquity have a uh, fellowship with thee? All right, you can't drink the cup of the Most High and of devils, man. That's right. I got, I got, I got another one. Go ahead, y'all. Y'all throne, that's the throne of iniquity. Y'all grandstanding. Y'all in y'all place, though. Y'all those same guys coming back, man. Those Pharisees, those guys that tried to exalt themselves, man. Come on. Hey, yeah, we, we can end on that. The scripture started with the John 7, the French John. Come on. I meant this. John 14, 24. Let's oh, constantly got something. John 14, 23. Yahweh answered and said to him, If a man love me, he will keep my words. My father will love him. We will come unto him and make our bow with him. And so you got to keep the sins of the heavenly father. You believe it on me as the scripture said. You got to keep it the way it is, man. Fuck how people feel about you. In fact, he tells you people going to come against you, man. <laughs> they tell you you're going to be hated. It tells you these things. He that loves me not, keep it not my sins. So y'all ultimately out of murders of Yahweh Shai, man. Y'all mm -hmm. killed him. That's right. And the word which ye hear is not mine, but the Father's will send me. Y'all ultimately against the Heavenly Father, man. And it says in Jeremiah 12 that uh, the Lord's heritage uh, crabbed after him as a lion, right? Murdered after him as a lion. Mm -hmm. It's against him. Right? The, uh, in fact, these things have I spoken unto you, being yet present with you, but the Comforter, which is the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name, so you got to teach them names, Yahweh Bashanah Shai, and that's who it's about, man, proclaiming their righteousness. He shall teach you all things, 100% truth, and bring you all things to remembrance, whatsoever I have said unto you, man. So what's so hard to, nobody damn word was your truth, man. What's so hard about that? Y'all got faith, man. So since y'all think nobody has to the truth, you're going to make up and add to whatever parts you're lacking in. Because you've been disobedient. Now you're putting lies in there, man. You're adding them or taking away. All right? Doing the work of the Lord deceitfully, holding back your sword. It's a lot of brothers. So it's like the word. Right. Uh, this is uh, Isaiah 8 and 20. 
It says to the law and to the testimony, if they speak not according to this word, it is because there is no light in them. Right. So basically, you know, if you're not being on the same accord and you're speaking another doctrine, basically you don't have no light and you be uh, considered a liar, man. Yeah. You got something else, Moana? No. Moana. 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 Come. I got John, the eighth chapter, and um, I'm gonna start at the thirty-seventh verse because because it, because it, it's to you niggas, man. If you niggas, hey, this this is to you niggas. I'm gonna start at verse thirty-seven. It says, "I know that ye are Abraham's seed, but ye seek to kill me because my word have no place in you." I speak that which I have seen with my father, and ye do that which ye have seen with your father. And we're going to find out who your daddy is. <laughs> Verse 39, they answered and said unto him, Abraham is our father. Yahweh Shai saith unto them, if ye were Abraham's children, ye would do the works of Abraham. But now ye seek to kill me, a man that had told you the truth, which I have heard of the Most High. This did not Abraham. Ye do the deeds of your father. Then said they to him, We be not born of fornication. We have one father, even the most high. And that's what you niggas saying, man. But you niggas born of fornication. How? Because you niggas got all kind of different doctrines. Niggas hanging with niggas that don't even call themselves Israelites, man. Where is that in the scriptures, nigga? Disagree with you. Re read and promote another nigga shooting up the Bible that you read from. Fucking madness, man. Verse 42, Yahweh Shai saying unto them, If the Most High were your father, ye would love me. For I proceeded forth and came from the Most High. Neither came I of myself, but he sent me. And in John, uh, I believe it's the 17th chapter, he said, He that receiveth you, receiveth me, man. That's the chain. So to, in order to uh, uh, receive the Most High, you got to receive Yahweh Shai. In order to receive Yahweh Shai, you got to receive the men that he sent, man. And that's starting with the apostles of Great Millstone, man. Right. I mean, even the scripture tells you, he told Peter, on this rock, I should build my church. So that's there's a head. There's always a head, man, a leader. It's simple. The brothers read the scriptures, be ye followers of me, as I am of Yahweh Shai. Yep. It says, I'm going to read 42 again. Yahweh Shai said unto them, if the Most High were your father, ye would love me. Which goes back to if you was of Yahweh Shah, you would love the men who uh, uh, who are preaching his word, man. Who are preaching of him. You would love, hey, you would love Great Millstone, man. You would love the apostles, the elders, and the brothers who teaching the, uh, the gospel in truth and in sincerity and with charity, man. It says, verse 43. That's uh, like uh, 42. It says, Yahweh Shah said unto them, if the Most High were your father, Ye would love me, for I proceeded forth and came from the Most High. Neither came I of myself, but he sent me. Why do ye not understand my speech? Even because ye cannot hear my word. <laughs> That's the whole point. He's like, look, if you can't receive it, man, hey, it's because you, you're the wicked one, man. Mm -hmm. Why can't you receive my speech, man? Can't read that over, brother? Kind. Verse 43, it says, why do ye not understand my speech? Even because ye cannot hear my word. Ye are of your father the devil, and that's who your daddy is, man. Mm -hmm. In the lust of your father ye will do. He was a murderer from the beginning and abode not in the truth. And the also, same. Uh, mm -hmm. also, you can't control yourself, man. You're, you're of, that's who you're, you're going to read that over, the lust part. Yeah, it said, ye are of your father the devil, and the lust of your father ye will do. The lust of your father ye will do, man. You, you can't help yourself but go after uh, your lust, man. Mm -hmm. Your vain fucking desires. Whatever the fuck it may be. Okay, so like, you know, it says he was a murderer from the beginning and abode not in the truth. Just like you niggas, man. You have not received the love of the truth. That's right. It says, because there is no truth in him. When he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own, for he is a liar and the father of it. And because I tell you the truth, ye believe me not. Which of you convinces me of sin? And if I say the truth, why do ye not believe me? He that is of the Most High heareth the Most High's words. Ye therefore hear them not, because ye are not of the Heavenly Father. 
It says, uh, Then answered the Jews and said unto him, Say we not well that thou art a Samaritan and hast a devil? So they turn around and want to call him a heathen, man. Right? You what Yahweh Shah said to them, Yahweh Shah answered, I have not a devil, but I honor my father, and ye and ye do dishonor me. So when you dishonor uh, 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 the apostles, matter of fact, we still got to get that about the doctrine, blessing the doctrine. All of them got it. Timothy, right? Okay. Because it says that, uh, but I honor my father and he dishonor me. So when you dishonor the prophets who are representatives of Yahweh Yahweh Shah, then you're dishonoring the, uh, uh, the heavenly father and his son, man. It says, verse 50, and I seek not my own glory. There is one that seeketh and judgeth. Oh, shit. You know, so Yahweh said he didn't uh, uh, seek his own glory. This is John 7 and 16. Yahweh answered them, my doctrine, one doctrine, is not mine, but his that sent me. If any man will do his will, he shall know of the doctrine. One, whether it be of the Most High or whether I speak of myself. He that speaketh of himself seeketh his own glory. But he that seeketh his glory that sent him. The same is true, and no unrighteousness is in him. And that's all that matters, man. Teach the truth of Yahweh Bashmi Shai, man. Without care. Like it says in uh, Sirach. I think it's Sirach. Maybe it was in Solomon. All right? When you get the wisdom, man, you should quickly be without care, man. Huh. You understand what you got yourself into. You count the cost. You know what affliction is going to come. <laughs> and you, you move through it. You endure it. All right, with joy to Yahweh Bashmi Shai, man. The joy, like it says in our songs, man, the joy of our salvation. Purge me with his soul. That's right. This is 1 Timothy 6 and 1. That as many servants as are under the yoke count their own masters worthy of all honor. Under the yoke means doing his work, man. That's right. Their own masters worthy of all honor. Who is your masters? Who is your teachers? Who is Isaiah 30 and 20 speaking of? Who is Jeremiah 3 and 15 speaking of? Who is the eldest that uh, 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 that Paul wrote and ordained elders of different uh, uh, heads in different churches? The first, the second Ezra. So I we got to end it at some point. Yeah, yeah, we <laughs> gonna end it. We gonna end it. Well, I mean, it's spirit. It's not the spirit, but yeah, at some point it has to end. <laughs> <laughs> what you want the second chapter? Yeah, the end of it. You said for leaders. For lead kind. So who is, who is this? I, I had this earlier, but I had dropped it. But the spirit wants to come spirit back wants, up. Spirit wants like the wind. In fact, I probably named that like the like spirit like the wind. Child. Uh, you know. Do we on the tooth? Oh, you ended with that? Yeah, yeah, we ended okay. on this. If you want to, or you want to end with that. Got spirit working out. You told me Timothy, but hey, I'm gonna go with it. Uh, let as many servants as are under the yoke count their own masters worthy of all honor. In the name of the Most High and His doctrine be not blasphemed. And that's the point, man. Count your own masters who are worthy of honor, you know. So, so the doctrine be not blasphemed, man. So when you come against your elders, the apostles, hey, because the apostles and elders of Great Millstone is the apostles and elders of all Israel. So when you come against them, you're blaspheming the doctrine of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah. Thus saith that scripture. And so doctrine uh, definitely means something. And they that it's so it's plain who's who. And they that have believed the masters, let them not despise them, because they are brethren. But rather, yeah, did we just read First John that uh, uh, the nigga that hated his brother is a murderer, man? Huh. Uh, but rather do them service, because they are faithful and beloved. All right. Uh, and the elders been through a lot of shit, man. Without stopping, man. Without taking a break. And increasing in the, the doctrine and the faith of Yahweh Shem Yahshai. And the word for service, do loyal, or however, do the you owe. Uh, second definition, metaphorically to obey, submit to, in a good sense, to yield obedience. Hmm. All right? To, be, to uh, be slave to, to serve, do service. Hey, man, because if, if it wasn't for the apostles and the elders, man, hey, you wouldn't be calling on the name of Yahweh Basham Yahweh nigga. Hey, you wouldn't be teaching that Cornelius is Israelite. Because mm -hmm. you following, the, uh, you going to Masha, the, uh, 
you niggas at the Monster Rock Summit, man. Yeah, you niggas teaching the uh, Edomites can make it. You can't hate Edomites. Cornelius was the Edomite shit. What? Well, hey. That's because they afraid it. They don't fear you how much you're shot. They fear Esau. They they they, they they love money, man. They are they 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 father, they, they father the devil, man. I'm saying, guys, like I said, man, y'all that same wicked government that crucified Yahweh shot, man. Okay. Yep. And, and hey, y'all had no king but Caesar, man. Hey, man, y'all didn't want the uh, Lord to come take all y'all had, man. Y'all want the kingdom now, man, where well, you haven't received your consolation. Which obviously they trying to make it here. Masharai, y'all the government of Israel. In, in, in captivity, man. Right. In fucking America, man. Get the fuck out of here, man. I got, I got a precept. Uh, this uh, Titus uh, 1 and 10. It says, for there are many unruly and vain talkers and deceivers, uh, I mean, especially they of the circumcision. Especially you niggas that know you Israelites, man. Come. Hey, and y'all about Shem Yahweh said it in First Peter that he's going to start at his house, man. Come. Who? Hey, the first heads to roll is the heads of that old government, man. The old order, man. It's, hey, man. And it remind me uh, on Blade, man, when Deacon Frost came in and killed all them old motherfuckers at the table and shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? As our Lord's come, the first crowns to go is y'all's, man. Who, uh, this, uh, Titus, uh, 1 and 11, whose mouths must be stopped, who, who subvert whole houses, teaching things which they ought not, for filthy lucre's sake. Right. It's all about money with you guys. Filling they serving their own belly. God. They that are such serve not our Lord Yahweh Shah, but their own fucking bellies, man. Can I read that next verse? Okay, brother. Uh, one of one of themselves, even a prophet of their own, said the Christians are always liar are always liars, <laughs> evil beasts, slow bellies. Always liars, man. Keep on reading that fact, verse. In Romans oh, okay. 3, it said, Romans 3, it tells you, that's how you're going to be uh, justified, man, is by keeping the sins of the Lord. That's how you're going to get salvation, man. God. Uh, verse, verse 13. This witness is true, where, wherefore rebuke them sharply, that they may be sound in the faith. They rebuke them sharply, man. <laughs> Right, that they may be sound to the faith, man. Okay. Hey, you can't get it after two admonitions, reject. That's right. Admonish, reject. Oh, yeah. Is it more? Or that is? Um, <laughs> oh, I'm going to read it again. Uh, not giving heed to Jewish fables and commandments of men that turn from the truth. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Which is you niggas, man. First Timothy 6 and um, 2. And they that have believed in masters, let them not despise them, because they are brethren, but rather do them service, because they are faithful and beloved, partakers of, of the benefit. These things teach and exhort. <laughs> These things teach and exhort, man. If any man teach otherwise... And can say not to wholesome words. Oh, wholesome tongue. All right. Is a tree of life. Wholesome. In yeah. Proverbs, right? Yeah. yeah. Hey, grab a hold on to your house shot, man, that path. Huh. To the tree of life. Wholesome. Who go, who he got, you know, to be sound, to be well, to be in good health. Um, hey, just like the scripture says, be sober. When you look at that word sober, it means to be sound, man. To be whole. Yeah. All right. It says sound at the bottom. It says sound, uncorrupt. Look, figuratively to be uncorrupt, true in doctrine. <laughs> Did it say true in doctrines? True in doctrine. One. Right. Oneness. Of, of Christians whose opinions are free from any mixture of error. 100% true. <laughs> right. 100% true oh, doctrine. Hey, hey. You, yeah, you niggas can't never go into your doctrine without going into the Greek, making a Greek and Hebrew out of the doctrine. Hey, niggas, because your ass getting cut out that shit, man. I mean, 
this well really it says wholesome. All we're doing is telling wholesome me. Like shit. <laughs> How you gonna know what it, what it means? Aren't you supposed to know what words mean? All right, don't you look up definition. I'm just looking up a definition. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Yeah. If a motherfucker says uh, yeah. a foyer, if I don't know what a foyer is, I gotta look it up. Oh, foyer is the definition. Right. Oh, it goes back to oh this language. Right. What right. the fuck? <laughs> That's how you understand something. Right. <laughs> That's, <laughs> that's called reading. Right. Yeah, <laughs> right. If somebody says shit to you, somebody says shit to you in Spanish, you don't understand. You might think he insulted you or something, so you go Google right. translate, try to see what he said. Commandments. You only go to understand. Commandments of men that turn from the truth, yeah. man. And we're supposed to make this. Uh, we're supposed to make these uh, scriptures plain upon the table. Right. We're supposed to make it clear. It says make the uh, make that ministry clear to improve that ministry, right? To declare, to, be, to to declare that means to make it clear. It did say to publish, to make, make public. public. Right. Come. If any man, First Timothy six and three, if any man teach otherwise and consent not to wholesome words, even the words of our Lord Yahweh Shai mm. of Mashiach, and to the doctrine which is according to Godliness, do doctrine, and to the doctrine which is according to Godliness, man. One. Singular. Right, wholesome, one hundred percent true doctrine, man. According to Yahweh Shai, man. All right, this ain't, this is not for uh, for us, man. This is Yahweh Shai's words, man. We're not doing this because uh, this is like our thing, man. This is what we were called to do, man. We just like we didn't wake up one day like nothing and just get to the Bible and start teaching some stuff. Hmm. No, man. Hmm. We were called, man. I was doing some dumb shit in the world, man. Yep. Like Amos said, yeah, man. Yeah, I was just about to go in there. Hey. I was not the father of a prophet. I mean, the son of a prophet. Right. None of that, man. He was, was just as hard as sheep, man. He was sheep. This is the word. This is the word of the Lord, man. Um, he is proud, knowing nothing, but doting about questions and strifes of words, whereof come of envy, strife, railings. Evil surmisings, perverse disputings of men of corrupt minds, and destitute of the truth. <laughs> destitute of the truth, man. Supposing that gain is godliness, from such withdraw thyself. This is second Ezra is one in verse thirty-nine. I'm gonna start at thirty-eight. It says, And now, brother, behold what glory, and see the people that cometh from the east. Unto whom I will give for leaders Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Oseas, Amos, and Micaiah, Joel, Abdias, and Jonas, Nahum, and Abaku, Sophonias, Agaias, which Haggai, Zechariah, and Malachi, which is also, which is called also an angel of the Lord. Mm -hmm. And guess what? All these men is back today, right? And they all speaking the same thing. Because they got the Masharai Yasharala, right? So you got the heads of all these different camps. So I guess those are your leaders. But they all saying different things. Right. Andrews didn't speak anything separate from Daniel. Esther's expounded on Daniel. Yeah. <laughs> right. Just like how Cola and Priscilla and... Uh, yep. Yep. They found it more to Apollos. Apollos. All right, Apollo. Come. Mm -hmm. Anybody got anything else? Or is there more to that? No, no, that was it on that. That was it. Anything else? I'll say something. Tell me, I'll stay there. Hey, so with that, you know, Lord willing, hope we was edified. We was kind of uh, a little long winded today, you know. I hope it was all edifying, though, to the spirit. All praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to our, our apostles and elders of all Israel. And salutations to you brothers who preaching the gospel in truth and in, and in sincerity and always with charity, man. Who's right. doing it in the order of the male, the, who's teaching his word directly and correctly as Yahweh by Shamiah or Shai ordained us to teach it. Shalom, brother. Shalom. Shalom.